to Aaron Charles Rook Johnson, and actually to every other exquisitely beautiful female that's trapped in fat. Uh, you know what? You're one day going to metaphorically love me, okay? Because I'm a guy that discovered, you know, all you got to do to uh, vanish all that fat on your body is put stevia into water and drink it. And Michael Jordan, number 23, it's that time after the hour. And what have you done with your money to help your fellow mankind, sir? Uh, you know what? That's not fiction, Mike. If I was a billionaire, what I could do is build a casino, okay? And then I'd let you come there, and you could play all you want. And I would, you know, fucking say it's on the house, dog, okay? You know, if you actually... You know, orally stimulated your female partner, played the violin, Michael Jordan, and uh, validated that, yes, it does upgrade the Kama Sutra, and it's a miracle that every woman on the planet should actually experience, at least once before she dies, according to Karen Alberto. Fact, not fiction. And uh, Aaron Charlesworth Johnson. Fact. If you validate either Stevia, you know, in one of its capacities as a miracle, okay, on Facebook, or perhaps the violin, what I'm going to do is I'm going to retire you. Uh, the Charles Brooke Johnson, is that rich? It kind of sounds like it, but, you know, uh, <laughs> things can be misleading, okay? Uh, as you know from dealing with most of the men that you've met in your life, okay? Seriously, all right? And fact, not fiction, I know how evil... And fucked up most men are, okay? I've seen the best of it. I've been handcuffed to a tree, kind of like in the same position as, uh, you know, Jesus. Only it wasn't uh, nails through my hands. It was, you know, handcuffs over a tree branch, okay? For four and a half hours. And then Lou Holtz and shit uh, firing me for making the play. I get fired, Aaron Charlesworth Johnson. For making one of the greatest stops in the history of Notre Dame football, I was a fucking predator on the football field, girl. Seriously. You know what? Fact, not fiction. Uh, if you were thinking about having children in the future, uh, you want a superior uh, dose of genetics. Uh, what they should do is let me go to a sperm bank, you know, and, uh, you know, hook your kid up for the future, okay? See the play. Know that I'm insanely fucking strong, okay? And insanity. You know what? Uh, the flip side of genius, is it not? And in fact, my IQ before I started fighting, they said it was 154, okay? It was off the charts, but it was in abstract theory, which is chaos, okay? And that's what life is, all right? And in fact, uh, yeah, uh, I tell Craig Tusher, Aaron Charlesworth Johnson, uh, about mice exploding in population, you know, and turning into raving fucking, I mean, they turn into humans, worse, okay? No, not quite, because we're about as bad as you get. We eat our own, and we don't give a fuck, and then we say it's all in the name of Jesus, and we hold the rest of the world uh, at the barrel of a gun or an atomic bomb and try to spread the magic of fucking, uh, you know, what, capitalism? Because it's worked so fucking well in America. And you know what, girl? It's like this. America is a colony of England, all right? They threw it to us, okay? Because they knew that money would enslave us just like it does everywhere else, all right? And they threw about half their fighting force against us. And it's like this, girl. I'm going to be the richest man on this planet, okay? Uh, whether I'm alive or dead, okay? It's going to be my name. People will probably try to steal some of that, George Streeter. You know what? Number 27. It's after the hour. I'm going to go into the uh, tanning booth, okay, and handle my business. In fact, not fiction. Uh, I was faster than you, George. They should have put me in your position, okay? And you know what? Uh, no, and they should have put me uh, on the drop-in. And then instead of figure out Russian and Marty Lippincott and nose tackle, and I'm saying that's the best defense in college football fucking history, and we could actually almost prove that in court just based on – game film, okay, in high school and on the practice field at Notre Dame. And Aaron Johnson, what I'm saying is that you could actually become globally fucking famous. And, girl, it's like this. You're exquisitely fucking beautiful, okay? You just have too much flabby, all right? And I've discovered how easy it is to vanish it, okay? Uh, if you drank eight teaspoons per gallon of sweet stevia water, uh, it would happen quickly. If you drank pure H2O, girl, it would happen virtually overnight. If you drank, uh, 
pure H2O and everybody in your family did, they would go lean, healthy, and perfect. And you know what? It would expedite you guys becoming retired, okay? And because it would expedite me becoming rich. And that violent thing, girl, fact, not fiction. You're an adult, and so am I. And if you're one bit attractive, uh, I would be honored to be the first one to ever play it on you. <laughs> Peace out, girl. Uh, I'm off to uh, maintain my tan and shit. And I don't know what John Lynch's number, but John Lynch, NFL, fact, not fiction, based on my game film, okay, and practice film, and, and you know, things that I did and shit, uh, they could have put me in your number easily, and I could have filled your shoes and surpassed it, and they could have put me you know, in Jack Tatum shoes, because I'm um, faster than Jack Tatum ever was, okay, and you know what, uh, I was bigger, and I could hit, and I did a bond of pool, and what I'm saying to any NFL player out there, okay, until you learn how to fight, I would kick your fucking ass and shit, you know what, uh, if you were an asshole, Ben Roethlisberger, but if you were cool, you know what, we would get along well, and that right now, when I'm on three teaspoons of hash, and, you know, a lot I mean, copious amounts of the bomb stevia. What I can do is uh, turn into a robot and, you know, uh, kick the shit. I mean, I, I could fill Jack Tatum's shoes, shut down the Raider backfield, and I'm staking my life on it. Peace out. <laughs>